Hi, welcome to Steaks 101, Marinades, Seasoning Blends, and Rubs. You know, steaks are pretty good all by themselves, but using a marinade, a seasoning blend, or a rub are great ways to add flavor to your steak. We're going to cover each of those for you. We're going to start with marinades. Marinades work best with the value cuts, such as a brisket, a flank steak, or even a flat iron. So today, we're going to, for our demonstration purpose, we're going to use a flat iron. We're going to make an easy marinade here. We're going to start with some olive oil. some lemon juice. You always want to have some kind of a, an acid in a marinade, usually either citrus juice or vinegar. Now we're going to add our garlic, fresh chopped garlic. We got some chopped oregano, some chopped rosemary, some kosher salt, and some black pepper. We're just going to mix this all up and this will give us a real simple Mediterranean steak marinade. As a general rule, you want to use about a quarter cup of marinade for each steak. Once we got it all mixed together, we're going to go ahead and put the marinade in a reclosable baggie. We're just going to put it in there. Now this recipe made about a cup of marinade, which is perfect for our four steaks. We're going to go ahead and put our four flat irons in the bag with the marinade. And while we're doing that, we're just kind of mix everything together. Maybe give it a quick little stir inside the bag. But you don't want to use too much marinade. So we'll go ahead and zip that bag shut. Work the marinade into the steaks. And then we're going to just put it in the refrigerator like this. Best to leave it overnight. And we like to turn them over a couple times to, just to make sure the marinating is hitting all the different sides. Now marinades are really good for, for firmer pieces of meat because they break down the fibers in the steak and they make the steaks more tender as well as adding additional flavor. Now we're going to cover seasoning blends and rubs. You know the difference between a seasoning blend and a rub is a rub will generally have less salt in it because you're going to use more of it. And a rub will typically have some coarser ingredients and you're going to really coat the steak with it so it's going to add a textural element to your steak as well because it'll crisp up on the outside. I'm going to show you how to apply a rub. We want to start by oiling the outside of the steaks. We always like to put a little bit of olive oil on the steaks. Then I like to take a clean plate and just pour our rub right on the plate. Now this is our Southwest Chipotle rub. This is a great rub, especially for these beautiful filet mignons. Now we're going to go ahead and just coat both sides like that. And that'll stick to it. And that's going to give us that great rubbed flavor. Okay, the seasoning blends are even easier than the rubs. We've already oiled our filet mignon, so it's just a matter of sprinkling some on a steak. Today I'm using some of our Omaha Steaks All Natural Seasoning, which is a great all-purpose blend that really brings out the best in these filet mignons. So that's really the lowdown on marinades, seasoning blends, and rubs. So the next time you're looking to do something a little different with your steak and take it to the next level, give those a try.